Hello and welcome back. I am really excited right now. So I'm I'm also a little bit tired, but I just got back from traveling and now I'm back and uh, getting back into recording and stuff like that. But as soon as I came back, I got a notification on my phone for a trailer that dropped for a new game that very epic my brother made. Now I say game kind of with like quotation marks around it because it's it says that it's a very epic experience all i've seen so far of it is the trailer and the game page it's called vapor drive and i'll just read the description bathe in the vibes as you cruise through a new neon city sit back and take in the scenery by putting your car in auto drive enjoy your own beach just to import your audio in the main menu so from what it looks like is it's almost like a interactive music experience that you can use your own music for he did make one of like one of the main menu tracks himself he actually composed it which is pretty impressive because from my experience in music synthwave can is a pretty involved uh process let's freaking go <laughs> i am so pumped for this Anything he makes is just so much fun to play. I love seeing things that he's made because he's still new to new to making things, but also it's just like I understand the process a bit because he talks to me a lot and how he's learning new things. But man, I just want to say, if you haven't seen the trailer, you got to go watch this trailer. That thing absolutely freaking slap. Oh, the little spinning thing. Oh, that's so cool. Very. Oh, man, this this feels like accurately aesthetic to the time. All right, I'm going to be freaking out about this the whole time. I'm not even going to. I'm not even gonna apologize for that because hey, I love supporting him and what he does, and I love seeing the things he makes. So importing tracks, so you import your own tracks. All right, so I got three songs here. Oh, a little loading bar. So um, it this must be one of this must be the song that he made. If he made that, that's pretty good. All right, controls. W to accelerate, S to slow down, to steer. I don't want to know this. All right, I have I have no idea what this game is about. I don't even know if you can drive the car. If you can't, if you can change the views, I don't even know what it is. So, let's freaking do this. Oh, oh, that was smooth. Oh, you can drive it. A and D to steer, E to auto drive. One and two. I didn't read that. Whoops. So can you hit the walls? You can hit the walls. Oh, and you can stop. Ooh, you can't go backwards. That's fine. This is so pretty. Oh, come on. Yes, change of scene and it's getting to the city. All right, let's try E auto drive. Oh, the little A for auto. That's awesome. All right, so I think... Is this playing my music? I'm not sure if this is my music or not. This is my song. There you Oh, it actually has the title of the song right there. So this is my song. All right, let's get it, like, right in the center. There we go. So it does, okay, I was wondering, I, I kind of had the idea that it was going to be like an infinite driver like this. And it does change scenery, that is nice. Oh, wow. It does change from like, you know, uh, the rocky area to city. I was hoping it did that. Can you turn on the high beams? Turn off, I'm just seeing if there's anything I can do in this. This is cool. So it's, it's just, it's like an interactive you know, vaporwave video experience on us. That is neat. All right, let's see how fast we can really go. Is this top speed? This might be top speed. Oh, the speedometer actually changed. I wonder... I wonder. I wonder if he modeled this himself. If not, that's no big deal, but, like, the rest of this is just amazing. Visually, this is beautiful. So if you could get a plethora of synthwave music and just import it all, you could just literally have this plan and just enjoy it while you're studying or anything. This is nice. That is really cool. Oh, that's so cool. It's such a it's such a flawless transition between the menu and driving. It's kind of it is kind of like an interactive video. All right, let's um so controls one for previous tracks, two for next track. Okay, auto import tracks, I already did that. Credits. Music models program and sound design by Very Epic. Some models from the Unreal Engine marketplace. All right, of course it's made on Unreal Engine. Let's just sit back and enjoy this a little bit. I got some nice fresh water. You know, I just came back from traveling, I'm tired. It's time to just relax and take it in. Let's go next song. Vapor Drive. This must be his song. I'm not at top speed, though. Let's get to top speed. There we go. Very smooth. Very cool looking. 
I'm not gonna throw any critiques out there because I'm not a game developer, but I do know that how much work it takes to put in to make stuff like this. But it does say it's in development, so I'm gonna throw out some little things that personally I would like to see added to this game. It is amazing as itself. I think it's, it's an awesome experience. It's not really a game, it's an experience. A few things I would like to see added though is some level of customization on the inside of the car. There's not to be anything crazy, but like maybe you could have like lights that like flicker down there or maybe you can like if you play it for so long you know you get like an achievement or something and you unlock like a little dangly thing on the rear of your mirror little like maybe collectibles or maybe you can import your own thing that might be a little difficult but like if you could like unlock different like uh maybe from movies or games little uh dangling hang in there just maybe some small level of customization i think would be really cool even if that customization was like changing the color of the sky or adding some elements like uh water or something like that not saying it has to be there it's a great game just as a great let me rephrase that it's a great experience as as it is because it's supposed i feel like it's, it does exactly what it's supposed to it's supposed to be just kind of something you can work to you can study to i think it's perfect and you can import your own music to it, it doesn't even have to be vapor wave you know you can import anything into this um so that that is awesome but yeah uh, that's the only thing I would I would like to see added to this game is just a small level uh, Just a level of some form of customization. I think that would be super super cool I did have some assumptions coming into this where I was like, okay I I hope it does this I had I had two things or one really just one thing that I was like I would be disappointed if this doesn't happen and give you the ability to to direct the car and drive the car because I kind of had an idea of what it was going to be like. And I was like... <gasps> Kath is streaming. I kind of had an idea of what it was going to be like. And I'm like, but if you can't control the car, at least by going left and right. I didn't even think slowing down, but at least left and right. I, I would have I been like, oh, it just needs that. It just needs that little touch. But it had it. So honestly, this was awesome. But yeah, anyway, if you want to play the game, I highly recommend you try it. One, because... It's super cool. Again, not game. Experience. And the experience can be altered and changed to your specific liking with the music that you choose. So anyway, yes, please go play the game. Check out the trailer on his YouTube channel. It's also on the Itch uh, page. Um, one, because it's super cool. Two, it's my brother, and I, I think I just appreciate supporting him. And other than that, thank you for watching. Also, okay, so I was also genuinely excited, or additionally excited, because the car looks like what I freaking just bought in Florida. Not a real car. A Lego car. This is a Lamborghini of uh, something or other. I didn't put the stickers on it because I don't ruin my Legos like that. But it looks just like it. Look at it. On focus. See that? It kind of, it's white, but it kind of looks, it looks like it. It was meant to be.